Yeah, I'm really gonna do it. I'm gonna ask Liddy to be my date for the dance. Nope, I'm not gonna do it. If only I could do something to impress her. Oh boy, now's my chance. Oh, don't worry, Lydia. I'll save ya. Whatever are you doing, Bartholomew? Oh, I, uh... You're disrupting my practice for the horse show. Oh, boy. Oh, what's this? Fan mail. Hey, I've been invited to the Angel Awards Banquet. Yeah, but who would I go with? There's work to do. Hi, Angie. Uh, what's going down? Bartholomew's ego. He's got romance problems. Gotcha. Just call me Cupid LeBeau. Let's see now. Gotta make Bartholomew a winner with Lydia. Hmm. There sure won't be if I don't get out of here. Hi, Bartholomew. Kind of strange way to relax, isn't it? Who's relaxing? I'm getting into shape. Keep that up and you'll have a shape like a dented fender. What's with the bodybuilder? Gotta be ready in case Lydia needs rescuing or something. Forget it. That macho stuff is out. Ah, I did it! Girls go for romance and tenderness. Oops! Help! And I better go for my halo. Whew. Oh, I uh, guess they got away from me. That's no problem. But the fact that they're coming back is... Yikes! Let me out of here! Bartholomew's got the right idea. It's a good time to split. See? To impress Lydia, you should use less muscle and more mush. Floppy, where are you? Here, kitty. And there's your chance. Uh, to do No, you're a soft-hearted pussycat. Well, it's not very heroic, but okay. See? Nothing to it. <coughs> ow! 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 Oh, great plan, Andy! <coughs> yeah. Uh, I guess I should have explained it to Fluffy. You fruit! What are you doing to Fluffy? <coughs> Nothing compared to... Oh, what he's doing to me! Whoa! Oh, oh, look what you've done! You, you soft-headed ningapoo! Oh, I would have preferred soft-hearted. Oh, no! Fluffy, come down! Somebody do something! Don't worry, I'll save him! Watch Macho break the ice with Lydia. Oh, boy. Hope that's all that breaks. Cupid, eh? When it comes to the heart, LeBeau, you ought to stick to eye, ear, nose, and throat. Uh, don't worry, Angie. I'll come up with something. You'd better before he comes down with something. A broken leg, for instance. Oh, I hope he doesn't injure himself. Maybe Macho does work. After all, he is a prize winner. Bartholomew? No, silly. Fluffy. 
Come on, little Fluffy! Here, kitty! Whoa! Oh, help! Wow, that's a hard way to get on TV. <laughs> it looks like time for a spin-off. So much for Macho. Oh, I sure am tender. Oh, Fluffy, a little caviar will make you forget these ruffians. Caviar? Hey, that's it. Come on. What for? She'll never go to that dance with me. But she will with a sophisticated man about town. Who's that? You! Remember, man of the world, suave, experienced, sophisticated, clumsy. There's Lydia. Now, all you gotta do is take some flowers to her table. But I don't have any flowers. You do now. Girls get really soggy over flowers. She'll be a sense to go to the dance with you. Okay, you talk me into it. Now, where is she sit? Whoa! Oh, yuck! A cinch, eh, Lebo? Well, you gotta admit she's soggy. Yeah, and as Cupid, you're all wet. Uh, don't stand there. Go apologize. She'll never talk to me again. Trust me. Uh, oh, Lydia, I'd like to... You! You beast! Two dresses ruined in one day! Are you trying for a record? Uh, see? Who says she wouldn't talk to you? Remove yourself! I must go buy a new outfit! Whoa! He shouldn't have dessert. He didn't finish lunch. What do you know? A triple play. Uh, Bartholomew, maybe sophistication just isn't your bag. Look who's talking. Oh, there she is. So near yet so far. And so far, we ain't doing too good. Doing good. I got it. A baby buggy? What do we do with that? We show Lydia what a good guy you are. How? When she sees you babysitting, she'll go gaga. What baby? Who? Gaga. Boy, I feel ridiculous. You feel ridiculous. Well, well, Lobo, did you just want his bottle? Oh, come on, Angie. It's for a good cause. Knock it off. What'd you say, Andy? Uh, I said, let's be off. Now, we just stroll slowly past Lydia. You think it'll work? She'll fall apart. Yikes! Oh, something else just fell apart! Ease up. Stroll slowly. Remember? Hey, you're going too fast! That's what you think! Whoa! Uh, Bartholomew, babysitting doesn't mean you sit on the baby. Uh, if you're here, uh, who's doing the driving? Yo! We're out of control! Uh, I can't reach my halo. What? Uh, I said, why don't you say so? How are we gonna stop? Would you believe flower power? Why, Bartholomew, how sweet. What a beautiful corsage. Uh, corsage? Uh, Lydia, would you be my date and wear them to the dance? I'd love to. Now you may escort me home. Yippee! You mean all he had to do was ask her? See you around, Cupid. What's this? Hey! My invitation to the Angel Awards! Hey, Angie, wait up! I want to ask you something! Aliens, fact or 
of fiction. <laughs> I wonder, could it be someone hanging around up there? Hey, Lebo, you can fly. Why not a little space shot to check it out? Five, four, three, two, blast off! The bow. You're supposed to be going down, not up. But I want to check out outer space. Well, there's some space here for a few checks. Besides, all that dribble about aliens from outer space is just silly rumors. Now move! Spaceships, aliens. What will that kid think of next? I sure would like to run into one of those alien spaceships. Whoa! Oh, oh! Wow! Looks like one almost ran into me. Wait till I tell the kids. A ship from space! Ugh! Not exactly the kind of space I had in mind. Drivel, huh, Angie? Ha! Shows what you know. I'm not kidding. It was shaped like a big disc. No, a saucer. Yeah, it was a flying saucer. You mean a real flying saucer? Well, it sure wasn't a wind-up. There it is now! Hey, Bartholomew, wait! If it was good enough for me, it's good enough for him. Basket, two points. What the? Ah, there's our aerodynamic disc. I feared we had lost the toy. Toy? But I thought... Well, he said it was a flying saucer. Not this. What I saw was the genuine article. Oh, Angel Face, you're too much. I really saw it. A flying saucer going about a million miles an hour, heading for Oakville. Wonderful. An opportunity to observe an alien spacecraft firsthand. Yeah, it's also a wonderful opportunity to get out of here. And there is no cause for panic. The strange craft is not a landing force of aliens. These phenomena are merely special effects in Mogul Studios' latest space epic. To repeat... Maybe there's a news report about your flying whatchamacallit. Unless Bartholomew covered my set. Panic. Invasion by... Aliens. Moguls. You heard him. That whatchamacallit was filled with alien moguls. Wow, I gotta go find Spence. Good idea. Glad I got it. Let's... Not so fast, Lebo. What's going on? Not now, Angie. They're here. We're being invaded by aliens. Come off it, Lebo. Nothing but rumors. Oh, yeah? Well, these rumors are big, with one eye and pointy ears. And it was on the news. Alien moguls invading us. On the news? Really? Hmm. Maybe there's more to this than I thought. Would I exaggerate? We'll discuss that later. Now I have to report those aliens to the home office. Be careful! She should have told that to Tina. Oh, no! This is too unbelievable! Ugh, you're telling me! She wasn't kidding. This is unbelievable. Tell me I was exaggerating, Angie. Huh? Did you call me Angie? Uh, who? Me? Why would I do that? But you said... Shh! We don't want him to hear us. Look! Those creeps have got Spence! And I got a problem. Tina, you go for help. Okay, I think I know what Haggle is. Haggle? 
That's help. Now to get rolling. Oops. I meant me, not you. Got it. Don't got it. Oof. Hmm. Got you this time. Wrong, Lebo. Look, I just won my halo. We can dance later. Yikes! Looks like a gold-plated rubber band. Let's hope it still works. Oh, boy. Angelica isn't gonna be too happy about this. I'm not too happy about it myself. Andy, where are you? Oh, no, Haggle. They must have captured Andy, too. No, Spence. No, Andy. That's just dandy. That outer space race should get off their case. We gotta find him. You check over there, I'll go this way. I'll do my bit. Come on, let's split. Hey, now, do you suppose those crazy threads are Martian clothes? And who would ever realize this groovy jumpsuit's just my size? Just put on the hat and dig a Martian cat. The Space Age Stetson's mighty tight. It doesn't let in any light. Yow! Let me go! You don't want me out here, sick. Help! Shape up or I'll send you back to the factory. About time. These foreign jobs are getting fancier all the time. Here goes nothing. Ah! Just what I need. An alien stick shift model. Oh, help me! One of these doohickeys must stop this hot rod. <laughs> that Martian Derby doesn't do a thing for Haggle. <sighs> Glad I'm rid of that crazy lid. That bubble was trouble. Haggle, you okay? Calm, cool, and collected now that I am disconnected. Looks like you need a can opener to get into this thing. Hmm, she's right. Not a doorknob anywhere. What do they think they'll find up there? A doorbell? Makes me feel like a goof looking for a door on the roof. Hmm, maybe there's a door on top. Whoa! I'm making a takeoff. Who took the brake off? Looks like I better put the brakes on. I gotta thank those dudes inside. They changed my fall into a glide. Hmm. First time I ever played second fiddle to an alien. Let me out of here! Hold on, you two. Why the panic? Mogul Studios? Oh, no. A movie company. And I'm the star jerk. Spence, you okay? Of course. You ought to view the array of technical equipment inside. It's quite impressive. They even let me do a liftoff. Phew. We thought you were captured. Uh, where's Andy? I have no idea. I have an idea. In trouble, that's where I am. Hi, gang. Uh, just been around the movie set. Movie set? You told us it was a real UFO. It isn't cool to fool. Spreading rumors makes bad humor. Yeah. Sorry about that. Oh, Apologies. So, that's all right. Okay, Don't worry. Right. LeBeau, you and I are going to have a little talk. Oh, uh, Angelica. I can explain. Your rumors made me the laughing stock of the front office, LeBeau. But, but Angie, it was just a little mistake. Anyone could have made start moving, LeBeau. Now, I'm in trouble, and that's no rumor. 